Hey gang, how's everybody doing? I just want everybody to take a look at this. This is the dry mix I'm going to put into uh, these two pillars here. I just want to let you take a good look at what I mean by a dry mix. So I'm going to shut this off so you can hear me better. So I'm trying to do this one-handed, so you'll have to sort of excuse me there. So this is the dry mix that's going to get packed into uh, these sonar tubes here. This is also a mix I would use for when you've seen I've done the dry pack on the uh, hand pack on a torso. Uh, I've got a few different torsos, but and I, if you want to get that crack to that old look, this is about what you want your mix to be. I hope you can see this good. You can see it's it's still quite crumbly, dry. Like see how it'll just fall apart like this, but it'll also still keep a ball. See, it'll still form a ball if you let it form a ball. So you, I, when I drop it in, I just do it by the scoop and I just lo a little bit at a time, let it fall into the tube and I just a light tap on it. I, I don't really bang it. I don't want a smooth finish. I want nice voids and that in it. Anyway, I just wanted to give you a quick look at what a dry mix was exactly. Uh, you would never want to do this <laughs> for statues. Uh, you'd have a big mess on your hand. So anyway, that's a, just a quick look at uh, what a dry mix is. Okay, everybody.